Yo, what's up you guys said this is your man Epi here and I'm back here with another video game gameplay. Today I'm gonna review this game called Control. I've never played this game before and honestly this is kinda bit new to me and since it was free on PlayStation Plus I'm gonna do a review on it and see what I like about it. If I don't like it I now I know. I might have already uninstalled it. <laughs> so let's get to it. Let's see. This thing is pretty small, honestly. Let's see. The option seems pretty small too. Alright, new game. Um, brightness. But that much would be good. Fine, that's fine. Uh, yeah, hope it doesn't try to bother me. This game has no difficulty. Okay, so it is the hard that it is. Now I heard this game has a lot of glitches, but I'm not sure. Honestly, I heard it does. Can you play with this? No, you can't really. Ah, oh, shoot. I thought you could play with that. <laughs> but yeah, I heard this game has a lot of glitches, and I'm not sure if it still does. I heard they fixed some of them for because like they released it for free. I heard they fixed some of them because of that. But I'm not sure, so we'll see. Fair warning. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. Okay. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. Nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. Uh -huh. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. Hmm. The picture is something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, ugh, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, Sometimes, something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen, freak out. And try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Okay. Hello? Anyone here? Alright. This does not seem too complicated. Alright. Um let's see. Um not have you do not have any memos. You do not have any clear levels. Collectibles. 
FBI file. Um, it doesn't seem like there's anything else in those files. Rather than this, but I don't think that's the point right now. Uh. Although I'm not having any glitches so far, so. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Is she having a dream right now? Is this what it is? Staffing surveillance data international condition. Minor office equipment janitor cost more moreover or HQ liberal cost for the cost breakdown. Huh. Bit oddball, right? I know the sprint already, I pretty much already learned how to do that. Oh, this is the bathroom? <laughs> Are you saying boys or girls? Oh, it doesn't even matter what it says, I guess. <laughs> Federal Bureau of Control. All these years, I've been looking for them, and they were hiding in plain sight. Well, no, the fair bureau is mostly in GTA 5, so no, not really. <laughs> so they're not really hiding. You're the one who hasn't even looked far enough into the universe. This is so dark. I'm checking this. Let's see. No, not this. Hello, Ash. You all should know by now the R4 report are due by the end of the week. We are still waiting on them from the num a number of people. If you need an exam, please request form R4 a form your supervisor. If you think your export from filter in an R4 you need to get buyer permission from the department chief saying so. Remember R4s are mandatory under section 75.2 of employee manual. If R4 required in the department please contact the employee department head doctor Oh, Miss, Miss, Mr. Sir, Mr. Connors, and we need it. They're all, they'll be busy on Thursday and the annual policy review as please schedule according to best your team, your admin team. Okay. Hello? There's somebody here, that's weird. Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. The janitor, by the way. You'll work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, it, uh, you are no element. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you out. I've done uh, enough night shift loaner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No okay. Face. But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Okay. Um, it turns out she's looking for a job. 
since when she was looking for a job? I have no idea since when. And are you sure this elevator works? I mean, look at the caution sign right here, honestly. And, was this the same room I was just in? Yeah, this was the same room I was just in. My ass, why was it so blurry on this side? Look, watch, it's the... See, right now it's so blurry. But when you get close, see, it's so blurry right now. But look. You see? That's so weird. <laughs> Oh my god, that is so weird. Okay. The cell and the poster. Okay, I can't move right now. I was 11 uh, no, years old on. the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? I'm not sure why you're trying to pull down a poster, so that's a bit weird. Just like a very small introduction. There's pretty much nothing to moment. it. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. Okay, so now you have a brother now. What's next? You have a mother in law? <laughs> uh, that's actually pretty funny. Can I go through this? That's a big uh, That is a big door, honestly. Do not disturb. Investigate the noise. I don't think that's a good idea, but if you really want to do that, go ahead. Let's see. I am to be disturbed, not to be disturbed, cancel all my appointments for the rest of the week. I can trust them, Barbara, not a single one. Trace. Okay. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Is he dead? You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Are you sure it's you that's saying that? Because it's mostly me that's saying that. And there goes the poster. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. <laughs> Oh, look at this place. Where am I? I have no idea where you are, girl, but... Oh, you can jump too now. Okay. That's new. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, so I can jump across this. Huh, I can. Okay, so I have to do that. Oh, okay, that's a bit new. That's a bit intense, but that's that. pretty cool. Can I grab this gun? Yeah. I don't think you really need a gun since you can do that. Mm -hmm. Ah, reload. Oh, it recharges. Huh. Cool, honestly. So, so you don't run out of ammo in this game. That's actually not bad. Oh, hi. Man. Oh, shoot. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's like. I'm a Chucky Chan right there. <laughs> I just, this is not actually a bad game. I, I don't, I do not see nothing wrong with it that much. Who shoot at me? Oh shoot! Wow. Okay, I see some guy right there. And the game, the gun just recharges when you stop shooting. This is not a bad game. Oh, okay. Something's coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as director. Huh, duty. <laughs> Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Um, I could see that. Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? Um, I don't think so. It doesn't look safe. You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. <laughs> you. Oh, thank you. That was. horror. Okay. Got some guards up. The hotline. Secure line of communication. Guidance. Reach the hotline. What the heck is this? Oh, that's pretty cool, honestly. This is not a bad game. This is actually pretty good. Yeah. 
Ohoho. This would have been a bit cooler if they provided upgrades a bit though. I wonder if it does. Let's see. Am I listening to something here? Oh! That's that. This game is actually very cool. I have no idea what I'm doing. I just like running around and scoring the game. Oh, shoot! There's a cute cover. Can I shoot these guys? The hissing so. sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss. Burrowing into everything in this place. I really don't really want to read these scenes, but like, you guys can read them on your own time because this game is free, guys. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that yeah, makes you hum it like over and machine. over. What that janitor? I don't think we're even in the same world anymore. I almost died there. <laughs> this game is kind of difficult, but not that difficult, I'll say. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Help me fix it. Oh, what the heck is he doing? This is actually so cool. <laughs> Oh my, oh. Holy shit. You did it. We did it. Can you oh. hear me? Are you with us? With the Bureau? Are you still sane? I don't think this is we, honestly. Is that what they call? Compromise? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope. Emily Pope. Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh shit! You're the new director! Hold on! We're coming out! Oh, you're saying that she should have lied, but she didn't lie. I see. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow, this hostile force, this hiss, that works? Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. 
you are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Uh. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. Uh. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? <sighs> not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the Hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. You want me to push it out? Is he is he free? This has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. Jesse, over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. I need to talk to her. Where is she? I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us, or a few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench? The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. 
It's another object of power, like the gun, an old Bakelite telephone, a direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay. That's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Alright, that's all I gotta do for you guys today. I thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. If you really want me to make more videos like this, I'll be glad to answer because this game is not bad. That's a pretty good answer. That's a good interesting story. Although the story could be fixed up, but like honestly, it's not bad. It's actually a pretty good game. I care to you if you want to download it, go ahead. And it's not a bad game, I'll say. For the start, it's not bad. It's pretty cool. And honestly, the combat is not too complicated. I, I, I just wish that like, I just, I just want to see more of it now. But like, like this is all I'm going to show you guys for now. But if you really want to know more, play it for yourself, guys. It's just it's free for patient where for patient plus and all, guys. It's a good game and all. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed this, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.